Hello everyone and welcome to the third video of me basically talking about Bigfoot Beard Co and how amazing this product is. Um, those of you that know me know that I will not endorse any company or anything unless I firmly believe in it or if it actually does anything for me personally. Um, water. Sounds daft but water or anything along them lines my face goes up like a crazy thing. I think it might just be the water around the area that I live in, but hey ho, a little bit of redness, not as much as yesterday, but just a little bit of redness, no worries. Right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna start off with the lemongrass beard oil. This smells like just lemon, really, really zesty, really citrusy. Very, um, like you've gone into a fruit market basically. And then we'll top it off with the, my personal favourite, the Forest Beer Butter. Again, if you watch my other videos, you know what this smells like, but the wild, the wilderness, the limey, zesty. So I think the lime and the lemon combination will go quite well together, but we'll see. So, do, before you do anything, like I said last time, anything before you do anything to do with your beard, give it a comb. Go down. Da, da, da. Back up again. Moustache. Thought patch. Everything. Okay. Nice and combed. So, lemongrass beard oil. Again, I use about a quarter to a third of a pipette into my hand. See all the drops go in there. Always replace the lid because it will go everywhere. Let me get your hands working in, get the heat going, get all malleable and pliable. Straight onto the skin, and I swear, as I'm applying it now, my skin feels a lot more cooler. I don't really help the fact that my skin naturally goes red anyway, but I promise you, this isn't actually irritating me in any shape, way, or form. I just have a naturally red face, which is rather annoying and it's really hard to portray products, but I promise you, this is the case. Make sure you get under all the sides, all that jazz, any extra, whew, toss it in there. Come. Or a boar's bristle brush, I swear I will get you a lot better at saying that. And I would choose a wood or a metal comb or a plastic, it just goes through better. No dragging, I'm like zero pressure behind this, it's just going through. My hair is rather dense. It's not the biggest beard, but my hair is dense. Give it the five minutes. Now, like I said before, I am not just going to sit here for five minutes explaining that you need to wait for five minutes. Reason being, just gives it that extra bit of time to get into your skin, into your follicles, right into the shaft of where your actual hair comes from. Um, but again, I am going to do that. Forest beard butter. So, this is my favourite. As you can see, I have like gone crazy with this. Again, before I'm out, I use a bit more. I just prefer it. Use generally a small full amount, I use a bit of a larger full amount for my personal preference. And then, it goes all into your hands, straight over the beard, straight over, carry on. A little mess, through the beard, all the way, drop down again. Get it all done, nice, sorted, over the skin, and you can already see, I'm actually starting to get a little bit less red. I don't think that's got anything to do with the fact that this makes me less red. I just think my face has decided, ah, oh, we'll be in a different shade of red today. Into the beard, up, back down again, boom. As I said, the last video, always use your comb, go back over if you need to, give it that sharper line. Like I say, I go for the triangle, sloping triangle look. Back over again. Stash. 
solid. Right, oh, I should replace the lid, I nearly forgot. As this gets warm, sometimes it will just fall out, so you've got to be a bit more careful of all that. Okay, make sure I get all both sensor work into my hands. It smells like a lemon and lime, obviously, a combination, but it's got like a, a woody smell as well. That was be the why it's called the forest. Oh, what is it, pine? Well, yeah, lemon, lime, and a bit of pine in there. Um, and it just smells like I'm at a fruit shop or like um, when you open a can of Sprite or Lil or something like that. That's what I smell. 7 up sort of thing. But yeah, really, really nice, really refreshing smell. The lemongrass is a bit stronger, a bit of a kick in the face, but the uh, forest does balance it off better and make it a bit more of a neutral rather than a straight up kick you in the face level smell. Standard smell. Can't smell a thing. Again, back of the hands for me. You obviously flats for you guys. Let's work it through, and we're done. All right. Thanks for watching, guys. Please use my code capital S Sand twenty. You'll get twenty percent off throughout the sh throughout the store online. Um, there's new bundles for Valentine's Day coming up. Um, they are listed as a set bundle. However, if there is anything in there. That you either don't want or you want to replace with a different scent, just message the company and I'm sure Simon will get back to you rather rapidly and they'll sort out whatever needs to be sorted out. Um, yeah, there is a lot of stuff, cool stuff coming up in the next few months. Obviously, I can't say anything about this, but yeah, really good stuff. Um, I'll see you again for another day, maybe tomorrow, I don't know, for another combination. Thanks, guys.